Titanic disaster at sea, steam power. Titanic's power came from three huge steam engines. On the left and right sides of the ship, there were two traditional style reciprocating engines, the largest at the time and about 40 feet tall. The third steam engine was a turbine engine, which was powered by used steam from the reciprocating engines. 200 men were needed to keep the boilers lit, and when Titanic was sailing at cruising speed, they went through almost 600 tons of coal every day. Smoke from the steam engine went through the first three of the funnels. The fourth wasn't needed, but it was there because the designers thought the ship would look weird without it. Instead, it was used to carry the cooking smells away from the ship's galleys. To power the steam, there were 29 boilers, each one 16 feet in diameter, heated by no less than 162 fireboxes, where the coal fires burned brightly night and day. Each engine had four cylinders that filled with high-pressure steam and drove a crankshaft attached to a three-bladed propeller. Steam from the two reciprocating engines was fed to a turbine engine driving the central propeller. 